Okay, so now we're going to look at, we saw the 46 defense. And we knew what happened to them with the Super Bowl shuffle. I'm going to go into the next video on how that changed them. And I talked about the five families. And I said I'd let you know how that impacted the team. Let me draw the offensive line. My name is Brian Holloway. I played with the New England Patriots uh, and also with the Raiders. I was all pro a number of years. I played the left tackle. That's me right here. Okay, that's the T-Rex position, which means I'm going to face the toughest ball players on the team. This is John Hanna right here, who went into the Super Bowl playing with a broken neck. This is stuff that the defense didn't know, but that was going to affect our game plan because all Fridge had to do was hit him hard once, and we lose him. And the fact is, the doctor told him, he lined up on the field that could kill him. He did anyway, okay? Out here we have Mr. Dent. Over here we have McMichael. Over here we have Hampton. Now, I want to talk to you about the personal side of the business, okay? And then you'll understand how there's all sorts of stuff impacting how players really play. And there is an agreement among the teams that are influenced by the five families, which are all pro ball players that set the rules at the Pro Bowl. And Hampton had played, I, I, I don't know the number for sure, I, I think it was 12, maybe 14 years. Long story short, he played a long time. He was a legend in toughness. He was a good player. I wouldn't call him a great player. But the fact is, you guys lined up on the field. I think back then when he played, I think he may have had 15 operations on his knee. So when he was standing in front of you, okay, here he was in his football uniform. You see this knee over here. That knee was not the it would almost make you puke when you see him play. This is 99. Okay. And the five families determine what players you never cut. So you could easily take Dan Hampton out of the game just by cutting him, and he wouldn't be able to play anymore. But out of respect, the leadership of the league, the all pros got together and declared we are not going to cut him. There's no way. Out of respect and honor, that happens in the National Football League. Ball players make some decisions to protect him. Why? Because he was a baller. He brought it all. Okay, and he took the bullet. He would go in after games. They call it, give me a double cheeseburger. That means ice bags on his knees, the front and back. And after the game, he would go home. And in the morning, he would crawl out of bed. His wife would drive him to practice field. They'd sneak him around back so the press couldn't see him because he couldn't even walk until they rehabbed him enough to play again on Sunday. To this very day, hats off. i got nothing love for you, Hampton. Okay, You played it and gave it all. And I'll talk to you more about the other ballplayers at Super Bowl XX in just a minute.